Seaburn, what are the age ranges for the development? Uh, are there, is it zero to five? Because I'm representing the moms and dads out there that are wondering about developmental. What are the age ranges that you really got to keep an eye on? I mean, you can't, nobody's perfect. You're going to have issues, dings and dents here and there as, you know, going through life. But what are the, the ages you really got to watch out for? You know, there's a way in which it's almost 100% likely that the parents that are concerned about developmental trauma need not to be concerned, that they're already worried about their kids, right? They're attending to their kids. And then every, then we all have to deal with the fact that we were kids ourselves and that we have carried forward certain uh, issues and we have our own brains as parents and our kids are going to have to deal with whatever we, you know, bring into the mix. Um, it's clinicians that have to be concerned about developmental trauma. And the parents tuned into this workshop are, or this podcast are not going to be people that I'm uh, particularly concerned about. But the devastation, we have looked at the devastation in terms of sort of characterological issues or in terms of behavior issues or in terms of these devastating diagnoses when we need to be looking at it in terms of how can we help this individual who's got their own individual brain which has its own is is in is you know I've, I've described the brain as the the fingerprint in the quantum domain right everybody's got their own fingerprint it's completely unique right well, it's like we, we can't characterize a brain as other than uh, also unique. And that is in, you know, to me is that fingerprint in the quantum domain. So the developmental trauma is, a, is, a, is an attachment problem. It's when parents aren't, aren't paying attention to their kids for whatever reason they, they can't re help regulate this child because it's the whole process of affect regulation through attachment, through concern, soothing, empathy, understanding, attunement, that allows for uh, the baby to become regulated um, and, uh, and to develop ultimately a prefrontal cortex, which is beginning as early as age one.